Last week, a painting by Canadian artistic icon Lauren Harris sold for $600,000. The subject wasn't a landscape, but a street scene in Toronto. Dave Gary visits a young Vancouver artist who draws similar inspiration from this city's concrete jungle. For decades, this country has been defined by its landscape painters. We all know the big ones, the ones whose work now brings the kind of prices at auction that is almost more breathtaking than the original scenery. But you don't need any forests or trees or mountains to define the Canadian character. Just narrow your focus, stare up any alley, and you may have found the canvas of Randy Celebrini. You know, I think artwork has always been around where there's suffering and the, and the people around here put a lot of wind in my sails there. Unbelievably positive and a uh, huge part of what I do. And he does it in some of the roughest digs in town, surrounded by police and sweepers and junkies. But there is something in the urban topography that appeals to his eye. And the energy of these back alleys and rooftops gives his work the urgency of the street. I feel like if I'm not moving, if I'm not pushing the brush with rhythm and uh, trying to get it done, trying to get out of here, then it's, it's not painting. He's lived down here for the past seven years, stares out at those rooftops from an artist's studio now crammed with work. Randy Celebrini has a show coming up next month at a Gastown gallery, and the city's back alleys will be there in all their gritty glory. Whenever I paint the alley, whether it's um, the people on the street or, or everybody seems to know that architecture it's embedded into the vancouverites and we all know those alleys we've all peeked we do, down don't we will look up there, we know what's in that alley we've all peeked down and despite the suffering there was a kind of ad hoc thumbs up energy from windows overhead from people who inhabit the place day in and day out why not paint here why not exactly you get the real life thing the real life thing nothing pastoral in paint but the landscape of life nonetheless I think it's positive work and people uh, people think I'm kind of beautifying the, the, the area when, when I'm painting it and um, in reality I mean it's 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 breathtaking you know we've got some amazing scenes in Vancouver Dave Gary for City Pulse wonderful work very interpretive and we should tell you you can find Randy's work at a show on December 5th at the Irish Heather Whiskey Bar in Gastown's Blood Alley proceeds will go to the food bank right in the area where he paints it is